When two strangers meet for the first time in a sales environment, they're at their highest level of stress and fear. I know that whenever I first got started in the car business or when I first started selling cars, I was extremely, and when I say extremely, I'm just gonna zoom in for this. I was extremely, extremely insecure. I was extremely insecure and I was really, really young and I was working with people that were very, very, very educated and that made me even more insecure. So even the thought of walking outside gave me anxiety and it was something that took years and years and years for me to overcome. I think that's a normal thing. I think that whether you are 18 years old or you're 88 years old, anxiety of meeting someone new is something that takes practice. It's something that takes time. It's something that takes a lot of repetition in order for you to feel comfortable with. But as I worked and as I continue to go out and talk to new customers and meet new people, uh, those uh, fears and things started to fall down. So today, for today's uh, car sales tips of the day, whatever you wanna call this, this is video two. We're gonna talk a little bit about fears that we have or fears that customers have about us before they meet us. So let's start. What are some fears that we might have about the customers before we even meet them? It's definitely human nature for us to feel like we're going to be taking advantage of. Nobody likes the customer that comes in that wants to test drive 50 cars and then goes and buys somewhere else. And you can say all day long that you have to be a really good salesperson and sell them, but we all know that those people exist. And no matter how good of a salesperson you are, those scenarios happen. So uh, fear of wasting time is probably right up there at the top, right? Like you, you want to to make sure that the person that you're meeting with has the intention to make a purchase. So fear of being taken advantage of is something that is real and is uh, something that we definitely have a fear with before we even meet a customer. I think too, we also have a fear that we are going to sell them the wrong car. Or we're going to sell them the wrong product, right? Like if we, if we put ourselves into a scenario to where we might not know the vehicle 110%, it might throw up a little bit of anxiety or a little bit of fear that we might sell them the car that isn't right for them. And ultimately that's not what we want to do. We, I think, I think we genuinely are in the business of satisfying people and making sure that we're gonna give them exactly what they want. Another thing that we might fear is we might fear embarrassment, right? Like we might not, we might get put into a situation with someone or uh, say something that might embarrass us and that could be fearful as well. So I would put embarrassment probably on this list as well. Being a car salesperson, we've heard it all, probably. You've probably heard it all. And if you've just started in the business, you're probably starting to hear some of the things that we know are just lies. And customers lie, and just as much as they think that we might lie to them, they lie to us. So um, whenever we're in a scenario or whenever we're with a customer, we might have fear that we're gonna be lied to. Probably lastly, the last thing that I'm probably gonna add to this list is pressure. Customers don't wanna feel pressured as well as we don't wanna feel pressure for the customer. Whenever we get into scenarios where customers start pressuring us, uh, it, it's just uncomfortable for us on our end and then it's also uncomfortable for them on their end if we're applying uh, what we consider too much pressure. So those are some things today that I just wanted you to think about as far as what causes fear and stress out of us that could also maybe call, cause fear and stress out of them. That's your tip of the day, guys. That's your whatever you want to call it today. Salesmen, uh, we're going to be going through the whole entire sales process over the next couple of weeks. It's just something that I've spent a lot of time in the automotive industry and I haven't got it out in a while. And I just wanted to go through it uh, partially for myself, but more so for you. This is all for you. It's completely for free. So take what I talked about today. Go out, see if you're seeing a, a level of stress, see if you're seeing a level of anxiety of anything that we talked about today. And then if you did see that, maybe maybe send me a comment, maybe drop a comment on here and say like, hey, I was in the business today, I met this person and this happened, that would be pretty cool. You guys have a great day, I will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow we're actually gonna be starting the steps of the sale. So yeah, let's do it.